Alan, what are we looking at right here? Uh, we got three uh, no supports parts today. No supports is uh, our proprietary support list printing technology. Uh, what it allows us to do is print parts like you see here with very complex overhangs um, and other enclosed features that would otherwise be unprintable. Traditionally, these would be needed to have uh, cone supports, wall supports, something to support them, but our unique scanning strategies allowed us to print these parts uh, with no supports in them at all. Um, we're able to do unique geometries. We can print large spirals, completely large flat overhangs, um, which allow us to create some pretty advanced parts. As we can see here, this contains a number of domes, a number of uh, overhang surfaces all in a completely enclosed part, and this would uh, not be possible to print and have it be functional without the no supports technology. What industry specifically um, does the support list strategy target? Um, so initially, the support list printing is really targeted aerospace. Um, they have really complicated geometries, much larger parts, uh, integrated cooling channels, really complex gas flow, uh, really lends itself to this unique feature for being able to do support lists. However, in smaller parts, like as we see in medical device or healthcare, there is still a really big opportunity to reduce operator post-processing time, as well as remove more human variables from the printing process. The more of it that we can lock down at the beginning, the less we're relying on manual finishing or part-to-part -part variation after the fact.